motor weak is made possible by Auto Value and Bumper to Bumper and TireRack.com. What happens when you let enthusiasts and engineers worry less about tradition and allow them to do what they do best? Well, you get cars like this Chevrolet Corvette Z06. And what happens when GM lets us borrow one for a few days? Well, that's what we're about to find out. While the Z06 package first became an option for the Chevrolet Corvette back in 1963, it wasn't until the C5 that it described the ultimate track-focused vet. And while since then every Z06 has gotten more extreme, if we were plotting things out on a graph, this is where the line of performance progression goes from a steady incline to almost vertical. Yes, the latest C8 Z06 is all that. It starts with a brand new LT6 5.5 liter double overhead cam V8 that outputs 670 horsepower and delivers 460 pound-feet of torque. It sounds great too. The very aggressive nature of its flat plane crank design has it sounding and feeling like it's trying to shake its way out of the engine bay unless you unleash some of its fury. This dual camera featured a dry sump design from the get-go and is more racing engine than souped up small block being developed originally for the C8R race car. It made short work of Roebling Road Raceway's long front straight, able to reach 160 by the end of it. With Hellcats no longer rolling off the assembly line, this is easily our new favorite V8. But as you can imagine, Chevy has done much more than just plop a bigger motor into its rear midship engine bay which was easier to do since they didn't have to worry about anyone seeing over it. They've addressed just about every part of the car to ensure it puts that power to best use for coming out of corners like few other cars on the street. That includes upgrades for the short, long-arm, double wishbone suspension setup that can be further enhanced with an available Z07 performance package that adds more aggressive tuning for magnetic ride control and Michelin Sport Cup 2R tires, which can be mounted on 20 and 21 inch carbon fiber wheels with carbon ceramic brakes nestled behind. It all translated into more grip than a semi's worth of industrial strength Velcro through Roebling's nine turns. Like most Corvettes, the Z06 can be as wild or mild of an experience as you care to make it, but will most likely be the fastest car to show up at most track days. Yet the same magnetic dampers that void all body roll on the track provide an almost plush ride quality for the drive home, though not quite as plush as the standard Corvette. We're struggling to find something non-fanboy to say, Sure, the eight-speed dual-clutch gearbox doesn't deliver shifts with the brutality of some exotics, but really, they're just as fast, and the shifts are much smoother. Believe it or not, almost all the body is unique. So rather than just tacking on some fender flares, Chevy made the entire car wider to cover the 345 rear tires, yet keep the same uniform look in place. The optional carbon fiber aero package adds a front splitter, rocker extensions, front dive planes, and a huge rear wing. We're not sure if the multi-level nature of that rear wing was done for functional or aesthetic reasons, but it doesn't block your rear view, and that is much appreciated. We always talk about torque being more important than horsepower when it comes to acceleration, and the Z06 works with almost 200 fewer pound-feet of torque than horsepower. But you sure wouldn't know it when you mash the throttle. Easy to use programmable launch control allows you to dial in your preferred RPM for launching. We found 4500 was just about perfect for Roebling's front straight, allowing for just a tiny bit of slip before rocketing us to 60 on a 40 degree day in just 2.6 seconds. Power continues to pour on hard as the engine quickly hits its 8600 RPM redline, and gear changes happen often. 
The sound inside the cabin is intense. And when the quarter mile came to an end in 10.7 seconds at 130 miles per hour, it felt like it was just getting started. Government fuel economy ratings are a low 12 city, 19 highway and 14 combined. For the Z06, there are three LZ pricing points to land on, starting at $114,395. But you can go with the top of the line Z06, add 50 grand worth of options, and still come out half the price of anything you can compare it to. Call us home teamers all you want, but America's only exotic does it yet again. Not only is it the best Corvette ever, but it is also easily one of the greatest American cars of all time, arriving at a particularly poignant time culturally as we mourn the potential loss of internal combustion engines altogether. So come for the spectacular engine and stay for the complete performance package and experience that is the Chevrolet Corvette Z06.